Hi everybody, my name is Rachel. You might know me as Introventus on Twitch. I do a lot of body painting, a lot of cosplay, and a lot of art. I also do a lot of video gaming and things like that. But today we are going to actually be making some YouTube content. Don't worry, this is... This <laughs> We're gonna be taking a peek at what I have found this month. So I found a lot of really cool stuff. I'm actually gonna sit for a lot of this because it is a lot of things. I have one, two boxes and one, two, three, four, four bags of stuff. So the first thing I got for $1.99 is this cool Tales of the Peculiar. I thought that the book itself looks so cool and I like to collect books that are just like really pretty. I'm gonna read this, yeah. I also picked up another book. It's a classic horror book. Again, it's also just really uh, an attractive book for a shelf. Next, I found some Tolkien. They are like some really retro. I'm guessing they're like 80s, maybe 90s. Hold on, let me see the date in here. When were you printed? Tell me. Oh, 1973. Nine for mortal men doomed to die. I collect a lot of Lord of the Rings stuff, so this is going with my Lord of the Rings collection. Heck yeah. This cute little dragon boy. I also like to collect a lot of like medieval looking stuff. I am starting a medieval tavern area, so this is going to be perfect. I found these cool things. I think somebody on YouTube said that they were napkin holders, but I think that they would be really perfect to kind of like slip a palette, like a makeup palette into these guys and just kind of have them displayed on my vanity. I think that would be really cool. I am a sucker for things like this. So it was disgustingly dirty, I need to clean it, but it is really beautiful. I could probably put a little garden terrarium in here. Also here's a cute little candle holder. It has very nice ornate designs on it. I got this like urn thing. I just, I love antique brass, really heavy. So I know it's like good, good stuff. It is a beautiful, look at this. It's a beautiful purse. I'm going to wear this with Ren Fair things. It just has this beautiful etching on here. So this, actually I'm going to take all this gross tape off here so you can probably see it a little bit better. This is really pretty. It's got a little like stopper. I just, I, I love this. I'm probably just going to display it. Or maybe like a little mana potion. I think it's just really adorable. And this is honestly what sold it for me. It was the really pretty crystal at the top. I picked this up as well. It's a really pretty chest that I'm going to keep some jewelry, probably some crafting supplies in. It does have like a nice little velvet lining inside, which is kind of cool. This is really pretty. Yay, storage. I love green glass. And it's got like a little symbol on the front that's just really elvish to me. And like, come on. The holy grail of all things you will ever find at a thrift store is framed. I go to Artist Alley's when I go to conventions and saw this one. Had to have it. I'm not really sure why I bought this. It's so stinking pretty. Look at all the leaves and stuff on it. It just screamed like elvish. Just, it's just too pretty to like get all gross with food. Does that make sense? Probably not. I don't care if I don't make sense. It makes sense in my brain. <laughs> Next bag of things. I got this urn thing. It's quite tarnished. Foul tarnished. It reminded me of Elden Ring. Let me solo her. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Goodwill tends to do these bags where they just put a bunch of random nonsense inside. I got these bags for a dollar each. This one really stood out to me and I'll show you why. <sighs> this plate right here it was like, it's probably an ashtray. I will probably use it to put little trinkets and stuff inside. But this bag that was also a dollar, it has some weird stuff in it. I mainly bought it for these little potion bottles for my Ren Faire outfits again. And I thought these were a really pretty shape that I don't really see very often. So it came with two of those. So I would be making little potions, probably leather straps and have them like sit on my belt. <laughs> the other things in this bag. I wonder who Doc is. I don't think I'm gonna keep either of these things, so. I got a little cute shelf that I'll be hanging on my wall up in my bedroom. I have a lot of gold and white decor up there, so this will be going upstairs. It's so cute. So this I found super last second. It was on the bottom shelf, kind of just chilling. I saw the Walt Disney sign on here when I flipped it around and I was like, okay, this could be something. I opened it up. Look how absolutely precious this is. Cinderella was my favorite princess growing up and I just, I love this so much. Again, I am <laughs> such a lover of silver. Ooh, they screw? Ooh, get screwed. The next bag. The next thing I bought was this. It is a metal 
thing. I'm not really sure what it is. Does anybody know what this actually is? Cause I have no idea. There's like a slot here. I got this really cute little sugar container. It looks like there's like a bunch of like gem crystals on it. And it came with this cute little spoon. I'm gonna scoop you up. So the last piece in this bag is mildly terrifying, but at the same time, I kind of love it. I, I can't really put my finger on why I like it so much. Well. My it's staring into your soul. It's so creepy, but pretty. I don't know. We're getting somewhere, probably about halfway through. Speaking of creepy, terrifying babies, I have two more of them. I got these for my Warhammer 40K costume. I kind of decorated up a little bit. I'm going to have them hanging from my staff. My Battle Sisters cosplay video is coming soon. I've been working on it for a little while. If you're interested in Warhammer or cosplay or knowing how to build stuff, I got a video coming for you. I found this cool mirror. It looks very elvish, cottagecore kind of. I vibe with that a lot. I love cottagecore stuff. I found three plant holders. They, none of them have tops. I think they were supposed to be shelves at first. What I'm gonna actually do is put in some flowers or some leaves or something, like do a little floral arrangement and then hang them on the wall. Very ornate. More shelves, ornate gold shelves for my gold wall. Perfect. I feel... Like I have a style and I know what I like because there's more shelves. <laughs> I'll probably give these a paint job, but there are more shelves. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is the last shelf, I think. Isn't it gorgeous? Yeah, I know. And I, don't, I don't know, it just spoke to me. This like wooden block with a piece of metal on it. It called my name. Rachel, please buy me your love wood. And I was like, you know what, you're right. It's giving royalty, it's giving maximalist. I love it. This is another thing that I found that I'm going to be using for my 40K costume. Oh, there's something inside. It's gonna have a paint job and I'm probably gonna put a bunch of really cool things on it, but I love the grommet in here. Oh, yes, a cute little candle. I am such a slut for candles. Also, goblets. I don't know what I have in here. Oh, yes, a beautiful candle holder. It's got beautiful etching on it. Look at that. I love it. I found this for super cheap, two bucks. Can't like see crystal stuff and not buy it. I have a problem. Save me. I don't want to be saved. It is a crystal ruby wine stopper. So fancy. I've got a hobbit's plate. And then I also have another candle holder. I found another photo frame, again, gold, pretty. Gonna put some art in there. I found a bajillion tablecloths and I'm gonna make stuff like skirts and things for the Ren Fair. YouTube video, maybe. Stay tuned. This is a brass thing. I don't know what it is. If you know what it is, please tell me in the comments. It's got a little like thing here. It's inserted into something. I'm always on the lookout for jewelry. I have this really pretty little leaf. It is a pewter necklace. It's a dragonfly. Here is another like antique piece. It's just stunning. Again, anything with a big jewel in it, I adore. I have to have it. Little leaves that you can add to any Ren Fair outfits. This piece here. What? Ma'am. Freya, what's the matter, baby? Huh? This piece here, very pretty. Had to have it. You like it? This might be my favorite find. This is a brass piece with an amethyst. Stunning. I also found these brass mirrors. Solid brass, these are very, very heavy, but also very beautiful. I'm gonna hang them on my gold wall. These are just absolutely perfect and definitely the style that I really like. And here's the other one. I also got a set of these little teacups. Very ornate detailing. It's giving royal vibes. It's giving get drunk. It's giving, I don't even know, but brain's dead. Oof. Is that it? Are we done? I hope that you enjoyed coming along on my thrifty haul. I've got a couple videos coming soon. The porcelain corset that I have been working on, and maybe you've seen a couple of snippets if you follow me on Instagram. Also, I am working on my 40K Battle Sister, which is really awesome. It's coming along great. So if you're interested, please hit that subscribe button. Please follow. Let me know what you liked best that I found at the thrifting and antique shops this month. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you later.